Hi, this is Raheem Zulfikar Ali from Excel Basement and in this video we will be exploring one of the very cool and awesome uh, feature which is introduced in uh, Microsoft Excel 2019 with the subscription of Office 365 and that is called Ideas feature. So if you are using Excel 2019 and you have the subscription of Office 365, uh, the Office version of the latest version will be update for you with the latest features and one of the feature which I found very cool and interactive with the data which is called the ideas feature. So let's get explore. I have a sample data on my screen and uh, if we want to do the quick analytics and visualization what our data is saying all about we can have this idea feature to apply. So let's get start uh, in the home tab uh, as you can see you will find uh, the ideas uh, feature let me just maximize this window so in the home tab uh, you will find on the right side of the ribbon uh, the ideas button so what we need to do is first i will select the entire database okay and uh, before uh, making it to the ideas uh, feature uh, let me just show you the columns and the pattern of the data is we we have the order ID column, then order dates, customer ID, all right. Then uh, we have uh, customer name, address, city, state, zip codes, country, salesperson names, regions, shipping dates and uh, shipping names, right. And then uh, moving forward, we have the uh, payment types, product names, categories, unit price, quantity, uh, revenue and shipping fee. So it's a complete database of uh, of a shipping company for example and uh, let's uh, understand that if we want to do the analytics quick analytics and we need to have the ideas what the database is saying uh, we need to do manual analytics by using formulas and functions or applying pivots and charts but uh, as uh, if we want to save the time and we, we need to identify that what our data is saying so we can use the ideas functionality with the latest Excel version, which is Excel 29 and Office 365 subscription. So I just select my data, entire data, and I will convert it, this data into the table format. Okay, so the shortcut key is to convert the data into table format is Control T, or you can go to the insert tab and click on table. So after doing that, uh, I will go to home tab and click on ideas. All right. And when I click on ideas on the right side, you will see the navigation pane of the ideas and it's now analyzing your data. And uh, it's still analyzing and very quickly it uh, shows you some preview about your database. And it provides you some charts and basic analytics. So if you can see this here, you have uh, first of all on your database, it's create uh, one bar chart. On the vertical axis it's the sale person and the quantity that uh, quantity by salesperson and the values are in thousands next is um, unit price has an outlier at order date uh, in 2014 uh, so 4th December 4th December 2014 has one of the uh, unit prices very outlier and higher so very quickly it gives you the analytics furthermore we can have some more visualizations for example, one more chart here says that for state or and product name chocolate biscuits mix, unit price increases over time. So suddenly we have a pattern over here and the forecast line as well. And last but not the least, here it says that category beverages has noticeably higher quantity. So very quickly we got the analytics and if we want to add, uh, for example, this particular chart in our sheet, we will click on insert pivot chart and very quickly it create one sheet and then we can analyze that uh, what has been done on the uh, particular date and uh, it gives you the that chart which was shown in the ideas pane and the pivot table as well with the filtering that particular criteria for you and for example if you want to have this particular chart click on insert pivot chart and it will give you uh, pivot table ready and the, the visualization as well. So I found this feature very interactive which is called the ideas feature and uh, it gives you intelligently the patterns read about the patterns 
So ideas, it's all about it. Ideas look for patterns in your data and it can be used for to create intelligent personalized suggestions. So explore this and I hope you like this feature as well. Thank you.